before you go, subscribe, like, and comment. Click the bell if you want notifications of new episodes. A view it asked about target size, so here's that. At 5.82 meters, one click will be 5.82 centimeters. For elevation, I allow myself a three click error window. One and a half up, one and a half down. So basically any shot that lands inside this circle is not considered an error. I only focus on the shots landing outside of this circle and I use this to indicate what sort of shooter error I'm doing. So today I'll focus on removing this. Second shot went high, and that was simply me not locking the left hand on the rear side properly. As you can see, I still have some shooter error, and the error is still not freezing up the left hand on the rear bag. So this is mostly the pressure between the head and the rear bag. But I'm not correcting for wind call, I'm just shooting for consistency. I have an ATEC A-lock on my silencer. Squeeze the rear bag so you lock the rifle. It's better, but I'm still not locking the left hand on the rear bag properly. Try bringing your left elbow closer to your chest and feel how the shoulders square up behind the rifle. You don't want to use muscle, so be careful about where you are placing your elbows. Don't start climbing on the rifle with your cheek, that will put the shot high. Today it's warmer, that also means there will be less air density and the bullet will strike a little bit higher. And here you have it, almost 10 degrees warmer and that qualifies for a significant change. If I had wanted to correct for the weather, I would have put the scope one click down before I started shooting. Hmm. Hoi! Hoi! Hey!
I'm frequently asked about magnification. I don't really worry about it. I just turn the ring until the image feels right. It's as simple as that, pay attention to position and your results will be immediate. The rifle puts the bullet where you tell it to and you communicate via the position. to the THLR channel by clicking the left logo icon so you'll be shooting straighter than a drunk skunk before the sun shines over northern Norway.